All day long, 27 First News reporter Cameron O'Brien has been sharing the story of Shauna Berry Scott. The Youngstown native went to prison, was granted clemency, and now dedicates her life to helping others give a second chance. New at 11, Cameron introduces us to Shauna's youngest son, Lester, and how he's helping make her dream to help others a reality. Lester Scott was 12 years old when his mother, Shauna Berry Scott, went to prison for selling drugs. It was devastating at first, you know, but yeah, you live, you gotta, you gotta uh, adjust and kind of adapt to it. But in his neighborhood, having a family member in prison isn't uncommon. Where I'm from, we kind of, we deal with returning citizens every day. You know, most of the people I know have either been or have, you know, kind of on their way. In prison, she dreamt of training people to get jobs and avoid prison. She calls it New Freedom Project. Lester is helping his mom realize that dream. Basically what I've been doing is organizing community meetings with the uh, kind of planting the seeds for a New Freedom Project. And they've got a lot of ideas in the works, including teaching entrepreneurship and encouraging folks in the community to get involved in politics. I see us being able to uh, launch it off in about a year. Maybe not the full scale of everything we have planned, but just a starting point, you know, just to get our foot in the door. In the meantime, Shauna and her son plan to keep working on getting funding and gaining support for the New Freedom Project. Folks interested in helping Shauna are more than welcome to contact her. That information is online at WKBN.com. In Youngstown, Cameron O'Brien, WKBN 27 First News.